Welcome to Pryor's Nursery. Today we're going to talk about cover crops and holding the soil. After we have finished harvesting one of our crops, what we do is we allow a cover crop to stabilize the soil uh, so it doesn't wash away because we want our soil for the future. If we use clover, the clover has a symbiotic relationship with the rhizobacter where the bacteria produces nitrogen for the plant and it gets to feed off the plant roots. So both parties benefit. Most of the nitrogen in the air is not available to the plant. So the clover and the rhizobacter are able to contain and grab some soil nitrogen and actually utilize it. So when we're ready uh, to plant here again, we'll till the soil lightly, incorporating this in. So we turn this under and we add organic material, of course, to the soil, which uh, reduces the need for irrigation. And then number two, we're in have nitrogen from the clover which enables us to use less fertilizer. It's something that farmers have been doing for 80 or 100 years. Here in Maryland we do it to try to keep the runoff from the creeks and tributaries that go into the lakes in the Chesapeake Bay. So um, the green giants love it having the extra nitrogen and we have our soil here for the future.